Hello everyone! Today I will show you how to patch Explorers of Sky using Xdelta. The first step is to download Xdelta UI from this site. I personally have had problems with this site lately regarding downloading, so if it does not work for you, there will also be a link to a Google Drive folder with Xdelta UI and a link to the original sources from Xdelta in the description. Once you've downloaded it, you want to make a folder where you're going to unpack the downloaded zip folder from Xdelta UI. If you downloaded Xdelta UI from romhacking.net, then you should have a readme file, an Xdelta exe and an Xdelta UI exe. This Xdelta exe is not the newest available version of Xdelta though, so it might not work correctly with every single patch. The folder I uploaded to the Google Drive does have the newest Xdelta version. To update your Xdelta, you need to go to the website xdelta.org, um, press on 3.1.0 and then search for a file named xdelta3 3.1.0-x86-64.exe.zip. Then you want to press on that file and download the zipped folder. Now you should move this zipped folder into the same folder where the xdelta UI exe is located and unpack it there. The next thing you do is delete the xdelta exe and rename the xdelta free 3.1.0-x86 underscore 64.exe to just xdelta. And that's it with the updating part. Now we come to folder contents of most ROM hacks for PMD Explorers of Sky. I will use the ROM hack Burnt Soil as an example. In there is usually a readme document which contains information about the ROM hack and what type of ROM you need. This ROM hack here needs a European one. Then there is the xdelta patch, recognizable by the .xdelta ending. This is the patch that will be applied to the base ROM. This patch also has to be in the same folder as the other xdelta files. Lastly, you will need the actual ROM. I won't show you how to get one due to legal reasons, but I have a European one right here. This ROM also has to be in the same folder as the patch and the xdelta files. Now we come to the actual UI. In the tab apply patch, the first line is used to select the .xdelta patch. The second line is to select the base ROM and the last line is used to set an output point. If you now press patch, it either shows this small message or an error message, which I will come to in a moment. If everything has worked for you, you should now be able to play the ROM hack. In case you have a European ROM but need an US one or vice versa, there will be links to convert them down in the description. Now common error codes I have encountered myself as well. First one is target window checks some mismatched XD3 invalid input. This means that you are using the wrong type of ROM. For example, you want to apply a patch made for a European ROM to a US version of the game, this is the error you will get. The second one is either unimplemented feature or something that contains the line unknown secondary compressor. This means that you need to update your xdelta version. And this is about it. I hope this video was able to help you patch your ROMs.